Plastic was really initially inspired by the fact that Iran, where I come from, has become the world capital of sex change operations, which was a bit of a surprise to me. Um, but uh, it, it's kind of loosely inspired by that. So what we've done using um, different sites in the country is to create um, uh, an installation performance based on the desire of mainly men in this case, um, who want to become women. The, the site, for example, in this case the Victoria Bath, becomes very much part of um, what the audience experience. It's not, it's not just uh, you know, something that happens in this space. The space itself is actually the star of the show. When the audiences come in, we tend to separate the men from the women, so being my sex change operations, and then bring them back together again, and take them through different experiences. Sometimes we guide them, not you know, tell them where to go, but by opening doors. And sometimes they hear somebody speaking to them about pickled onions, um, about salt in your food, or about sex change operations. And sometimes they just see, for example, uh, uh, video projections based on that. But it's all uh, with music and, and sound. Sometimes they hear a narrative uh, about a woman's life. Um, but these are quite disparate narratives. They're not sort of it's not part of one long story. So it's like experiencing bits and pieces of different stories, ideas, images, uh, inspired by this, this connection. In Edinburgh, I know the audiences came out, you know, elated, uh, shocked sometimes, quite surprised, but very su they'd never seen anything like that before, and quite expected. Um, so this will be a similar experience. The, the, the site will come to life in a way that it hasn't come to life before. Mm -hmm.